Hello and welcome. In this video, I will show you how I made this chopstick, which is also a blowgun. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. For the chopstick, I am using rosewood. Strips of the wood are cut from a larger 10mm thick sheet. We need 3 pieces of rosewood for this project. Joining surface of the wood is made flat using a sandpaper. I am using Dremel to cut a groove for the blowgun. I made this 3D printed contraption for routing using my Dremel. Depth of the cut is 2mm and diameter of the cutter is 4mm, which is the diameter of carbon fiber rod I am going to use. At first I didn't held it properly so the cut went like my career. So I cut a new piece and started again. Groove is shaped to final finish using a fire. Same thing is done to the other half also. I am using 5 minute epoxy to stick both halves together. Once the epoxy is cured, excess carbon fiber rod is cut using a hacksaw. Ends are made square with the help of an aluminium angle. Ends of the chopstick is made using teak wood and 3mm carbon fiber rod is used as a double pin. Epoxy is only applied to teak wood so that I can remove it later. Epoxy is cured with the pin inserted so that it will stay true. Same thing is done to the other side also. For the pair chopstick, I am gluing both wood pieces together. Using wood planner and sandpaper, I am making taper of the chopstick. One end of the chopstick is 10mm square and other end is 5mm square. Ends are rounded off using fire and sandpaper. Now I am making a diamond shape on the top of the chopstick. For finish, I am using clear lacquer. Any food safe wood finish will work. Now 
This is the first time I am using chopstick. Dot, I am using spine of this cactus. Comment below if you know the name of the cactus. When I was a kid, I used to practice blowgun, so I can easily hit it. Uh, maybe I need a bigger target. And after some practice? Effective range is 5 meter with this dot. After that, the trajectory is unpredictable. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and see you guys on the next video.